Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider. Howdy, Lone Star Rider here. This is my third day on the ride around Texas for Riding for a Cure. Y'all stick around. Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. This episode is brought to you by Sticker Mule. Sticker Mule makes the best stickers in the whole wide world, as far as I'm concerned. They make stickers for me, and if you want some stickers sold at some reasonable prices, and they, every week they have specials on their stickers. You just get on their mailing list and you can grab a sticker uh, at a great price. Their link will be down below with a $10 off your first order. Go check them out and tell them that Lone Star Rider sent you. All right, I'm glad y'all stuck around. Uh, for the first thing, I don't have a very good thing to report. Uh, the the Texas the Texas dam site here where I camped out last night um, was a nice campsite, but they're supposed to have showers and <laughs> bathrooms. Uh, I wouldn't. I wouldn't send anybody in there. <laughs> it's infested with spiders. It's uh, showers barely work. One of them doesn't work at all. So, anyway, let's take a look. All right, you guys, y'all need to do maintenance on this severely because this is terrible. I've been in a lot of uh, camp showers and bathrooms but this one is bad oh, the urinal's okay uh, spiders everywhere huh. certainly don't want to get bit by a spider in their showers back here pretty much non-existent I feel like I got cheated on my money They just ain't working. A lot of maintenance needs to be done on this thing. So. I didn't get a shower. <laughs> I'll find something to, later tonight, I guess. Uh, I knew that I would probably would have done baby wipes or something, but that's the way it goes. Sometimes when you're traveling, uh, this is kind of interesting here. I don't know what they're called. A bridge type thing. If anybody knows what this is called. I know what they do with it. You get in it and you cross the river. Or across gorges or whatever. It's on a cable system. I don't know if they use it this, these days now or what it was used for otherwise. But it's a... Uh, goes to the other side of Oklahoma over there all right guys uh, I'm headed out gonna find breakfast and then get kind of cleaned up somewhere and probably a, uh, a sink bath wash up but we'll do it otherwise this was a really nice place to camp <laughs> bathrooms are terrible anyway I'm leaving y'all Lone Star Rider here. I'm here in the uh, Main Street Cafe in Denison, Texas having breakfast. They have this build your own breakfast which is three eggs, hash browns, three pieces of bacon. It's a build your own and then you can get pancakes or toast. Oh, I chose pancakes and oh my god. <laughs> There's no way I can eat all these pancakes. They're huge. And they give you two of them. And they're about that thick. Take a look. <laughs> See, look. This is my hand. 
and they hang over the edge. Look how thick this sucker is. Oh my god, and they're good. Well, of course, I already ate the eggs and hash browns, but there's no way I can finish this. I don't think. <laughs> anyway, catch you later. Told you. They're good pancakes, though, aren't they? Oh, they're awesome pancakes, oh, yeah. and I did not finish them. Look at this here. I'm filming this. Look at that right there. And she said that, what was the record holder eating these pancakes? Six and three quarters. Six and three quarters of those huge ones. Now, they're not as big as the ones that lost Maple Cafe over in uh, Utopia, but these things are huge. Yeah, Utopia, the freaking pancakes is big around. Yeah. They, I ordered two, and they go, are you sure you want two? Yeah. <laughs> What's your name? Uh, Sally. You mind being on YouTube, Sally? Yes, I do. Okay, well, I won't put you on no, there then. I won't put you on there. Uh. Howdy, y'all. Lone Star Rider here. Still here in Denison, Texas, and uh, I had to turn around and come over here and take a picture of this place. <laughs> says the uh, Smith Mercantile Hardware and Hillbilly Museum gift and souvenir shop here so they're closed but I had to stop and take pictures so let's check it out it says a private collection of antiques are not for sale we got some stuff back there too see but got this old uh, I remember these litter trash cans I think these are Model T's or Model A's, I'm not sure. This one has skeleton in it. You got some really cool signs in the back. It's got a sign here that he repairs tires. It's probably one of those tires are over there. It's got a, a car lip there too. I got an old Justin boot up there at the top. Yeah, when I passed this, I saw, whoa, you missed it. Well, I did. I got a Statue of Liberty over there, a small one, Main Street and 100 South Coca-Cola Avenue. We got this Hearst over here. This is what really caught my eye. Has a flag on top that says Trump Train. There's the uh, Statue of Liberty back there. Right there. And there's that Hearst right there. Very cool. And I saw uh, something over here I want to stop and check real quick too. So, let's continue on. Very cool. I'm just down the, about a half a block from the Hillbilly Museum, and this guy's got some pretty re interesting uh, iron welding artwork of some sorts. I don't know what kind of car this is. Does it say? I'm not sure. This looks like this is from the uh, animated movie Cars. Got some pulleys on it and stuff too. Oh, and uh, I don't know who the guy is on the ground. <laughs> Got a gear back there. What that's for? But yeah, this guy. He's down for the count, whoever he is. Got this, uh, I don't know, is a horse or buffalo? It looks more like a horse or a cow or something. I'm about to get a buffalo. And some uh, painted artwork there. Very cool. And we know who this guy's from. This guy is from the uh, movie The Minions. Maybe the uh, third movie? Where they turned purple and became evil. <laughs> oh, they got a they got a, a minion inside there too. This looks like a dinosaur right here. And this guy, I'm not quite sure. 
We got a pooch over there. Hey, pooch. He's just a guy that looks like some artwork. Very cool. And uh, no trespassing. All right, I won't. We got a minion there. All right, well, it's time to get out of here. <laughs> when I'm leaving, the dog is barking. I'm gonna have to take the layer off. It's starting to get warm. Anyway, I'm heading over to the uh, a bridge. Yeah, this will be interesting. Lone Star Rider here. I'm here at the Carpenter's Bluff Bridge here in Grayson County. Uh, this uh, was originally a train bridge to be built between here in Grayson County, Texas and to uh, Bryan County, Oklahoma. Uh, they built it because they figured they could uh, save some money on uh, freight going from here to there. Uh, this bridge was built in 1910. Uh, and it was also built to withstand floods because in 1908 there was a lot of bridges that were destroyed by a flood uh, back in the day. Oh, back in the day when the floods took out the bridges between Oklahoma and Texas. <laughs> they eventually added on to where there could be traffic across the bridge and people with the uh, horse-drawn carriages and horse could cross the bridge back and forth uh, and then eventually it, it was updated to uh, take automobile traffic of course one car at a time one truck uh, and just recently probably about two years ago because this place has been on my uh, bucket list to check out um, I think it was about two maybe three years ago they ceased traffic going across you could actually drive across it if you wanted to still uh, but they replaced it with a more modern bridge over that way. So let's quit all this jabbering and go check out the bridge. It's very cool. Yeah, that's where the uh, train went across right there, which is uh, pretty darn cool. And, oh, by the way, I'm going to say a cuss word on here, which I typically don't. Um, will you be, you know what, doing all this graffiti on property and the freaking idiots with guns who shoot at these historical signs? Why do people do that? Why? You people are idiots. Quit it. It costs us money. On top of all this, because they got to replace that stuff after after a while, because people shoot them up, just stupid freaking idiots. All right, I'm off my soapbox. Let's go check out the bridge. Damn people! Look at I mean graffiti. Why, guys? Why? 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 Why do you have to put graffiti on the the stuff? 
I don't know what Porvana is. Triple, it's a cool looking daisy, but anyway, toxic, fake, man beater, I'm not sure. 2020, M.A. loves M.S. How nice. <laughs> Damn people, graffiti everywhere. All the way across the bridge. I don't think I'd walk on the uh, train tracks at all. <laughs> that would be uh, kind of scary. The nails are coming up. Wood looks rotten. Anyway, this is a very, very cool bridge. Of course, this part here was probably for the train. And this right here was for the... Uh, foot traffic if I would assume right and of course this is the uh, Red River which uh, goes around the top of the uh, Texas border that's right Oklahoma I said Texas border check this out that's the uh, the bridge that has replaced this bridge it is one windy day Just recently 2020, Ray and Sherry, shame on you. What the heck? Let's uh, walk all the way across and then all the way back just to say I did it. Yeah, I'll walk off some of those pancakes I ate this morning. Yeah, these things were huge. I'm in Oklahoma. There's some people over there. What does that say? Chit? Chai? Chai Town? Chicago. Oh, it looks like they do have a road up here. To access this side. So you can check out the bridge. More trash over here. Still the same graffiti. Man, I need to pick up this trash. Smells over here too. All right, well, let's walk back. I have walked the full span of this Carpenter's Bluff Bridge. Also, uh, to this bridge for the foot walk was also to access a community over in a community called uh, Carpenter's Bluff. So that's why the bridge is called Carpenter's Bluff Bridge. So that explains where the name came from anyway, if you cared. <laughs> oh, the bridge's pretty safe. How y'all doing? <laughs> you might freak out, but it's not too bad. It's awfully windy out there though. Is it? Oh yeah. Howdy. Good. Last night behind And I need to get some peace of mind And when I need some peace of mind I, I know where to find it there By the end of the road So I walk and I keep on walking Very cool bridge guys If you get a chance and you're out this way Stop and check out the Carpenter's Bluff Bridge. It's a uh, part of Texas history and also Oklahoma history. Uh, very cool. Love this stuff. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. I'm continuing east into the wind. Looks like it's supposed to rain tomorrow. I'm going to check the weather. I hope not. Maybe I'll go further away from it where it's at. Maybe not. All right, I'm continuing.
I'm here at the Fannin County Courthouse here in Bonham, Texas. And they're refurbishing it. Rebuilding it? I don't know. Let's look. It's pretty darn cool. Looks like they're refurbishing it back to the old uh, way. I'm going to have to find out. I'll look it up and I'll put it down around here somewhere. But take a look. Very cool. Refurbishing the carrot house. I don't know if they're putting these new blocks in here. They're, I don't know what they're made of. Concrete, sandstone. If they're refurbishing that and putting that where it goes or if they just redid the whole building, I'm not really sure, but pretty darn cool. At least they're not just replacing it with a modern building. I like when they do stuff like this. Awesome. Got a pretty cool uh, square here too. I'll do a ride around. So obviously I don't get to go inside and it looks like they pretty much gutted it. So I don't know how much of a original it's going to be on the inside. That's uh, would be a shame too. Yeah, it looks all gutted out. Hmm. Wonder if it's just a total rebuild. I am curious. Anyhow, I'm headed over to the state park. I'm uh, wandering over there. I may be back in town here to to uh, do a couple other things and then stay stay out there if they let me and find out. I hate being denied. I need to keep on going Cause I can't keep my mind off things I'd be better off to leave behind Gotta be careful Not to get stuck And so I walk And I keep on walking I found a sign. I saw the sign. I found a sign. Texas Historical Commission. It says the Texas Historical Courthouse Preservation Program. They're in partnership for the restoration 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 of the Fannin County Courthouse. So it's a uh, restoration, um, which is cool. So how much are they restoring? Everything? Anyway, that's what the sign up there said. Take a look. Right there. Squeaky brakes. Keep on going further Cause 
Cause I can't keep my mind off things I'd be better off to leave behind Gotta be careful Not to get stuck Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here I'm here at the First Christian Church uh, This uh, ch church attracted me over here because of the dome on the top uh, But it was built in uh, 1868 uh, by Charles Carlton yeah Charles Car Carlton uh, the guy was uh, born in England and came over here so anyway uh, let's take a look at this uh, church with the really uh, nice stained glass too but I want to see the dome over here is where I'm headed I bet that's beautiful inside that would be kind of a neat thing to see I don't know if that does any justice to the uh, stained glass. It looks like a, a protective uh, window on the other side of the stained glass. You can see they got the stained glass here. Just checking to see if it's open. Oh, uh, I don't know if you can see that, but yeah, that stained glass would be pretty from the inside. Oh, I wonder what this bell is. In memory of Colton College, where this bell was was from uh, 1867 to 1964. Very cool. All right. Well, can't go inside, so I'll mosey on down the road. The shoes I wear are a mess. I walk, 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 and I keep on walking. And I'm at the end of the road. Star Rider here. I'm here in Bonham State Park. Uh, all their campsites are closed. They're having problems here. They're getting redone. Uh, so no camping here. Bummer. But the ants did let me do a drive through except for through the campsites. Can't go out through there. They got a nice little lake. Got a park headquarters over here. Got people coming in free for the Veterans Day deal. I know it's not till Wednesday. How you doing? Doing well, sir. How are you today? All right. That's good. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I, I really wanna Bones know Texas, really wanna Phantom know. County Courthouse Bottom, 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 bottom. Bought him. Bought him. 
Bodham Courthouse. No, not Banning Courthouse. Bottom. Bottom city. City of Bottom. Bottom. Boham. <laughs> Howdy y'all on Star Rider here. I'm here at Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. I'm here at the Cuff... Man, that gum. Carpenters. Bluff. Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. Let's try that again. Howdy y'all, Lone... Oh, bleh. Man. Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. I'm here at the Phantom County Courthouse. Phantom. <laughs> uh, Phantom, Phantom, it's Phantom. Well, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, got you on the road. <laughs>